In this video, I'm going to show you how to make your own really cute and very on trend phone charm or phone strap. So this project will take you anywhere between five and 10 minutes. So it's something that's really quick and really easy and it will cost you between one and three pounds. It just depends how many beads you use and whether you want to make a phone charm or phone like strap. So if you're anything like me, and have done very little, very little Christmas shopping, like oops, first of all, um, and you're looking for a last minute gift that someone will actually want, then this is the perfect present for you to make for them. Or if you just wanted to make something a bit more personalized, then yeah, this is something that that can help with. So before we start, I just wanted to show you some inspo because I've been saving like screenshots of phone charms and phone straps, accessories, um, because they are everywhere at the minute um, and you can do it in whatever colours, themes, you could put somebody's name on it, you could put their children's name, like a quote even, you could literally do whatever you want. So yeah, here's some inspo because when I made mine for myself, my friends were like, oh my god, where did you get it from? Please can you make me one? And I could, however, I think you'll thank me more for showing you how to make it and then you can make as many as you want then. So yeah, you're welcome. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Well, I'm gonna show you everything that you will need. So you will need some thread that you're gonna use for putting your beads on. It needs to be quite strong. So I've just chosen this. It was like less than a pound for all of this, which is a bit crazy. Um, and you need it to not have stretch. I just feel like if it has stretch, it doesn't feel as secure on your phone and like, let's be honest, who wants to drop their phone? Um, not me. So get some without stretch in any colour you want. Um, I'll put links to this below. Um, you'll also need some beads. So I've got these, which are really colourful. Um, you can get loads of different packets of them. You can get some like ones with letters on, you can get some smelly face ones, you can literally get whatever you want. So there's so many different types of beads out there, but I, again, I'll link some below so you can see which ones I've used. You will need some scissors. They don't have to be like fabric scissors, any kind of scissors. Uh, you will also need a hair grip, bobby pin, whatever you call them. Uh, grab your beads and then cut your thread at around 30 inches or you can do it shorter or longer depending on what you want then wrap the thread around the hair clip and then start threading you don't have to use a hairpin but I just like to use it to keep the beads on the thread without having to tie an extra knot okay so you should have all of your beads on your string now so what you need to do is just fold it in half and then you need to tie a knot roughly about two inches from where the beads finish. So I just loop it around my finger and then like tie it in a knot. And you can tie this knot a couple of times just to make sure that it's really secure. So as you can see, we've got the knot there. So now, after you've done the first knot, you need to then make another knot um, just above where the beads are so this will keep this will stop the beads from like sliding around and give you the loop to loop onto your phone so again I just loop it around my finger and then tie that in a knot so now you can cut off the excess at the ends so now you've finished your phone strap I'm going to show you how to attach it to your phone so I like to attach mine here on the side, but you can always attach it at the bottom. But I'll just show you on the side for now. So you, what you have to do is loop it through, loop it through, and then you need to bring all of the beads through that hole there. So again, it's quite hard to show you, but just pull the beads through all the way. And there you have your DIY phone charm or phone strap. I actually made a longer one and you can literally wear it as a bag or a lanyard and I just love it. 